Item number SCP-3715, Object Class Euclid, Special Containment Procedures, due to its immobile and relatively benign nature. SCP-3715 does not require any specific containment beyond keeping non-foundation entities away. Personnel with Level 2 clearance or higher stationed at Research Site 95 are allowed access to the anomaly for morale purposes. Description SCP-3715 is an anomalous event that occurs in Room 121 in the former Bellevue City High School, located in Alberta, Canada. Note, Bellevue City High School has since been converted into Research Site 95. SCP-3715's effects typically manifest on weekdays during the fall and winter months. Between the hours of 11 p.m. to 6 a.m., a variable amount of tea will manifest in any suitable container. Note, suitable container defined as any clean wares intended to store liquid for human consumption. Within room 121, generation of tea will always occur, but certain variables such as flavor and brand of the tea may be controlled. Occasionally, in addition to the tea, a document will appear addressed to individuals who have recently entered the room. This document always takes the form of a handwritten note, giving praise and or positive feedback to the individual. The flavoring of the tea may be controlled by taping tea bags to a wall adjacent, in the event that the tea does not require a come with a tea bag. The tea will manifest as normal if the ingredients are placed in a plastic bag and taped to the wall. See below test log. Green tea bag from school stock. Videographer Stockton's mug. I hope you have a nice day. This was the first recorded instance of SCP-3715. Videographer Stockton was allowed upon request to keep the document from this test. Licorice tea bag. Generic teapot. No! This was the first time that SCP-3715 had been acting negatively to any stimulus. Site staff had been using many types of tea for several weeks before this event. Staff are discouraged from giving SCP-3715 licorice tea in the future. English breakfast tea bag. Generic teapot. See, Tan? Check your code again. Researcher Tan had recently completed several blocks of code for a device designed to more efficiently contain SCP beep. Upon inspection, it was revealed that the code held several typos that could have kickstarted a series of containment failures. The errors were corrected. Discussion regarding SCP-3715's ability to find errors in Foundation documents is ongoing. Loose Jasmine Tea Leaves from a nearby specialty store. Generic teapot. This is very good tea. Thank you. Next time though, try giving it to someone who needs it more than I do. The tea was shared amongst researchers. Imported Pular Cake. Retail price of roughly 40 US dollars. Generic teapot. Lab 4 was found to have been deep cleaned overnight. A note was found on a lap bench, reading, I wouldn't feel right otherwise. Addendum 3715A SCP-3715 was discovered in 2014, when reports of a tea ghost made their way to Foundation agents in Alberta. Notably, the classroom was last inhibited by Bellevue City teacher Betty Miles, who had attained mild popularity with in the school due to her optimism and willingness to assist students. Miles had suffered a fatal heart attack in 2013 while in class. Anonymous reports began surfacing shortly after.